It's come out very positive now. Wants to go. Umar Gul. Shahid Afridi. Both go down. No. One of these got to be up for the throw. It's like watching synchronized swimming. Wood. Well bowled. Excellent delivery. In swimming water. Darren Goff always throws himself into his work and has a little big on the set of it up here. And he's had a bit of a joke with Sean Watson, it's good humor start. And he's, here he is, Bobby Dazzler, having a bit of fun. <laughs> ...with the Grand Midwest Hotel Master Blaster Award, $500 belong to Shahid Afridi. May I invite the Pakistani skipper to please come forward. 49 of 29 balls. Miss Zara Shah will present the award. <laughs> Tell you it's a matter of the soil. A little relaxed atmosphere. <laughs> Hold <laughs> on a big effort from uh, Walsh and Bishop, and he got that. Also from Benjamin. They put it in their pocket. Umpire Mitchley forgot to give it back. There it is again. There it comes. She's got no idea. No idea it's coming. Oh, no! At least you can smile. Come on, you can smile. It's fine. Oh dear. I feel sorry for her. I wonder if she had a phone in. Oh, it's got him. It's got him. He's down. Happy either. Then they're going over to look after him. Well, Steve Buckmore went over there. Uh, Signaling dead ball. I tell you who isn't going to be happy, that's the batsman. He'd be really annoyed. That probably could have gone. West Indies were very disciplined yesterday, not so today. No, dead ball. What is that? Now, what is that? It's a no ball. It was over the front. I don't know what's going on. I mean, that, that, that typifies the frustration of the West Indies. I just can't understand this. That's something I haven't seen on a, on a test match field, I don't think ever. Down the wicket, and then, what, a, what was that all about? As Tate starts his last over to Grant Lambert. <laughs> Not the best leave I've ever seen. He's actually given himself that much room, he nearly fell over backwards. I was just about to say, he hasn't been dismissed for the year. Well, we saw Graham Lambert throw his bat when he was trying to run. He may as well not have had one there. I'm not sure what he was just giving himself too much room and probably not the best leave I've ever seen. Gracious me, you would not believe that that was possible. He got so excited, in came the throw, perfectly good too. He had all the time in the world. And have a look at the look on the face of the captain. Eddie Hemming's throw was perfect, and Steve Ward had given up. He wasn't, uh, he wasn't even trying to make his ground. Tufnell taking his eye off the ball. Hit 
Muniz Khan, just in the lower stomach. They're still struggling really technically to come up for a, a name that describes that area that isn't beating around the bush, isn't it? <laughs> He's bringing the spray out too. <laughs> That's not going to help, is it? It's going to make it worse. The cold spray. <laughs> well, the box might have to be as big. <laughs> I think Eunice has uh, refused the spray, and quite rightly so. so I'd just rather have a, a, a new abdominal protector, thank you. You can put the spray back in there, Dr. Riaz. Wonderful shot to reply. That uh, is a crisp off drive. They'll have to run him, I think. Maybe not. It just gets there. Uh, Mark Richardson. I'm quite sure what happened with the bat there. We'll have to wait and see. But that was a crisp blow through the offside. Whether he collided with somebody uh, looking at the ball, I'm not sure. Oh, goodness me. <laughs> He's still looking to run. The ball hasn't gone to the right. Good God, I've never seen that before. He's with, He's with him. He's with him. It all started with Murph down at the MCG. And it's a few of them can do with a bit of exercise too. Well, it's good to see some of the boys enjoying the tour. I know it's a bit of a hard grind. I think he's done all right with that. I think Nasser Hussain can see. And he'll know, he'll know him well enough. Essex men together. They can enjoy this moment. They know the game is gone. Now he's working him harder. Classic. <laughs> We're waiting for the last ball of this quite remarkable match. Steve Waugh needs to hit it for at least four. Keith Arthurdon needs to pin him down for less than that. Everything hinges on this. The series is level at two all. Here's the last ball. In the air, he doesn't get it. They've gone for one, they'll come for two. There's an invasion, and the return comes in. Madness here at border. Absolute chaos. Someone's gonna get injured out there. They're harassing the players. This is dangerous now for the players in the middle. Somebody snatched a bat. The police are out there surrounding Steve Wall. He's been jostled and pushed. Oil out. Ingerman's out now too. Monty Panasar deserves that wicket. He's persevered. Bob quite magnificently throughout the, the afternoon, the morning, the innings. And almost humiliating for the captain of Pakistan, who's been involved in the run out of Yunus Khan and now finds himself spread eagled across the sumps in the most uncompromising and ugly dismissal you could ever see. problem here, Tendulkar, well he might still be in, this is absolute circus out there, there is an absolute circus, take a breath everyone because you're going to have to see this in slow motion, I think for sheer entertainment value Anil Kumble should be given not out. There is and a magnificent catch, you beauty! This is 
It's Dinesh Kartik going flying across to his left. What a catch. They say that Dinesh Kartik is the two extremes. He drops dollies and he takes some spectacular catches. Just look at this one. Outside edge behind him. Flying. Horizontal.